ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back for round three of the torture that is Dark Souls 2, me and the Huntsman's Cops. I swear to God, I feel like I'm being hunted. You know, I kind of feel like that duck Ferdinand from Babe. A Christmas. A Christmas dinner, yeah. Dinner means death. Death means carnage. Christmas means carnage. So, I am sitting here wondering how in the blue hell am I going to get my souls back if I have to do this one at a time, at a time, at a time, at a time. And People don't believe me when I say this, but I used to be able to run through here and the Purgatory Guardians would stop coming after me. They just would. It's how it, they acted. I'm not sure what caused it, but until this latest patch, that's how they acted. And, and for the love of God, take a look at how these Purgatory Guardians have acted at me in these past two episodes. They're following me to the fucking bonfire that I just started this episode at. So, I suppose that all I can do is take it slow and cautiously. I, I don't want to. It wastes too much time, but that's the only way that I'm going to get my souls back. That is the only way. So, let's get this show on the road. Let's bring you all the fucking way back here. Because that seems to be like the only way that I can adequately do this. Now, if I backstab you, are your cronies going to come down and save you? Oh, of course not. Finally! Some one-on-one -on -one play! You're not so tough! Don't get too cocky, Star Fox. It's, it's Star Wolf. I've just conquered Wolf O'Donnell. Now it's time for... Andrew Oikeny, sure. Uncle Andros! You're gonna die next. I don't care if I backstab the bunch of you. It really doesn't matter. Alright. Pigma Dangar is next. Daddy screamed real good before he died. Or, uh, before he died. And then it once it get taken off by, uh... by... I don't even remember which one. But all I remember is that Pigma's uh, voice recording would always cut off early, which was really stupid. He, this is what I don't understand about you guys. You were giving me hell before, and now you're piss easy. Let's, let's not mince words here. You're piss easy, and don't get too freaking cocky, because if you do, you're gonna regret it. Now, backstab... I really don't give a shit if your your buddy comes down. Because it doesn't matter! See, this is the thing. I was sitting here, I was going about this the wrong way. Because I just realized that in the recording of Dark Souls, things are not the same as, as when people are cheering me on, like in a race or, or when I'm playing a Metroid game. No, 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 no. To, to my viewers, to my fans, I am the villain. I am the villain who must be vanquished for their amusement. Well, I could, you know, try and fight against that. I could try and be like, oh no, you guys should cheer me. But why not just embrace it? You can either deny it or you can embrace it. And so, finally, for the, for the duration of this entire series, since I know that my pain and my death brings great joy to all of you a very sound fuck you to all of you and haha -ha, you were wanting me to fail weren't you sublime bone dust and a fire seed that's gonna be useful all right so much for the villain losing bad guys win this, this is what i learned you know i i sat there and i actually watched the uh detroit pistons bad boys documentary on netflix a couple of days ago and you know what those are guys who embrace their absolute horseshit nature so for the rest of this game i will too and now let's go in and have our way 
with the most awesome. Well, no, 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 no! Don't, don't go into PSN mode. There we go. Bring up the gates. And I do mean the most awesome boss in the history of Dark Souls. The Executioner's Chariot! Holy shit, this is awesome! <laughs> oh my god! Alright, now, the question is, what do you do here? There's kind of a problem going on. Because... These skeletons have a necromancer! They have a necromancer that is reviving them. So your job is to go through and kill the necromancer before he fucking screws you. And, with any luck, hope to God that the chariot kills them for you. And this music. Oh my God, this music. And j just the atmosphere. The lights blazing by. You know for a fact that if you get hit by this thing, you are dead fucking meat. But it doesn't matter, because if the skeletons get hit, they're dead meat too. Well, until they get reformed by the necromancer, which is why it's your job to kind of go through. Oh, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked! Oh, shit, that sucked. I was, I was a little too slow on the draw there, but it's fine. Necromancer's right there. Gotta draw these guys out. Oh! Now, to my knowledge, skeleton type enemies and enemies with heavy armor, they're a little bit resistant to blades, but mace type weapons or hammer type weapons help to just absolutely screw them, which I think is why the, uh, those, uh, what the hell are they called? Iron soldiers or. The, the big, enormous guys from, uh... Um, Forest of Fallen Giants. I think that's why they took a little extra damage. I could be wrong about that, but... It just seems to be the case. Bring the gate down! And now it's time for the most awesome ownage ever! Oh! What a wipeout! So, the boss... Is not the person who was riding the carriage. It is, in fact, the twin-headed horse who is so imbued with dark magic that he will spit it at you, he will buck the shit out of you, he will charge you, and he's piss easy. Uh... Ow! Oh! Unless you get bucked like that, in which case you really might not get... Oh, shit, 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 don't... Welcome to Dark Souls. Did that really just fucking happen? I got to the easy part and I died because I was fucking fat rolling. I wasn't fat rolling, was I? I'm just an idiot. I'm just a fucking idiot. Well, laugh it up. Laugh it up, every single one of you who wished for my demise. Because... Ugh, my misery brings them laughs. So, I have to deny them my misery. I have to play better. I have to play like a pro. I have to not go crazy for their amusement because they're the bad guys. Not me. Every single one of you, this is your fault. And I was an inch away after that stupid ass jump. I was an inch away from getting knocked off. So that's nice. I've decided to give the club another shot. See, maybe if I can utilize its R2 moveset a little bit more. The answer is no. <laughs> it, it relies too much on a manual aiming. And uh, I really don't like manual aiming. Alright, whatever. Don't take too much damage. I just gotta do this again. Oh, why? Why why can't these guys start dying by now? Please. All of you just die. There there is no way this is gonna end well for me because I have not lost my souls yet during this this stretch of gameplay. 
And since I have not yet lost my souls, I think... I I'm... Knock on wood, but I think I maybe do. Holy shit. Ah! Fuck this stretch. Fuck the executioner's charity. I'm not doing this right now. Why the fuck did I open my mouth? Why in the fuck did I say that? Really? Did that seriously just happen? Fuck this club. I have given it enough chances. I have given it too many chances. I'm done. Fuck it. I don't care anymore. Get get a fucking great sword. I don't care if the next weapon I pick up has absolutely no goddamn upgrades to it. That is horseshit. My fucking god. My carelessness just cost me 20 grand. I had to say it. I had to fucking say it, didn't I? <sighs> Why? Why did I have to say that? Why did that just happen? <sighs> um, you know what? Pick up the fucking great sword. I don't care. I'll, I'll roleplay Cloud for the next little while. I really don't like using this weapon too much because everybody fucking uses it. But it's got a pretty decent move set from what I've seen. This is going to be my first time taking it for a spin. But uh, I guess Ultra Great Sword is going to have to be the way to go for right now because there is a hammer that I want that uh, ignites. And that has Ragnaros written all over it. But it's a hammer. It has the same fucking moveset as the club. Fuck it. I'm going to be using a big fucking sword that ignites. And the people who've played the game know what uh, weapon in question that I am talking about. But uh, for right now, all I know is that I have lost more than enough fucking souls to... to uh, and I'll get them back. I'll get him back. It, it's no big loss. I mean, th this move set it, it's an ultra great sword move set. It's it's a lot like uh, this Vihander. Although I'm fat rolling right now, which is not good. You gotta fight with finesse. You cannot fat roll because if you fat roll, you're a dead man. That's all there is to it. I really don't fucking like you, piss ants. I bet you didn't like that, did you? Oh! I'll tell you what, I liked that, though. I need to upgrade the shit out of this. That's all I know. I need to upgrade it. Why in the fuck? No, fuck this. Fuck this. I I'm out of here. I I'm done trying to do this stretch. There, There is nothing but misery that comes out of trying to do this stretch for me. I know when I'm beaten, and you know what? Fuck it. Enjoy your victory while you can, my selfish, selfish viewers who are wishing for the next big death. Because when I return, I will slaughter this area. I swear it, I will slaughter this area and everybody in it. I will for my own, own selfish amusement. And I don't care. I'm done with... Trying to go through the undead purgatory. Why did that happen? Why did I lose when I was sitting there? This is the first time I ever lost to the chariot. It's the first time that this area has ever given me any bit of trouble. And now, on top of everything, the chariot kills me. The fucking executioner's chariot. Awesome badass, but piss easy. How in the fuck? I don't know. I really don't know. All I know is that this greatsword must be upgraded. You know what else I know is that this uh, Titanite shard should be upgraded as well. There's two left. I would have enough if I had a soul to... Pl pl Please give me a soul. Please tell me I have a soul. You know what? Soul of Proud Knight, fine. I'll take it. I'll do it. This will give me a greatsword plus three, which is fine for now. Maybe more if I... Why me? Right, you gotta actually buy the Titanite first. Ha! <laughs> I'm so angry! Like, really? So fucking angry right now. How in the hell does that happen? 
Why the hell does that happen? Oh, you gotta have a big hammer. You gotta have the club. That club is what will help you land. Nah, fuck the club. Fuck maces. Fuck hammers. I know it's Ragnaros' MO, but fuck it. I don't care. Hell, you know what? I can upgrade this shit further. And you know what? I'm going to. I'm gonna upgrade this as far as I can. Which is plus two for right now. So let's do both souls of a nameless soldier. And, and just fucking call it a day. So talk. Yes, I see that you're busy, but I really don't care. So let's bring the great sword up one, bring the great sword up two. So it's a great sword plus five. Oh, I'm halfway there. I may as well get acquainted with it because I'm going to be using a big fucking sword. I don't care. I don't care if Ragnaros has Sulfurus. I don't care if he uses a hammer because this Ragnaros is going to be more practical. Hammers fucking suck. They just suck. I, I, I'm, I'm done trying to defend them. I'm done trying to roleplay because roleplaying leads to stupid fucking decisions. Unless, of course, you're me where I make a Jetstream Sam character who kicks ass at everything he does. Why the fuck don't I just continue this playthrough as him when I get to, done with this wing? That that sounds like a plan. If continue this playthrough and fuck Ragnaros once I'm done with the Iron Keep. That sounds like a good idea, doesn't it? Doesn't it? I'm so pissed off right now. This this is this is the worst I've ever done in this game. Part of it has to do with my build. Part of it has to do with the fact that I have not sunk enough into endurance. Part of it has to do with the fact that I'm just using too much heavy shit that has very little poise. I can't. I still can't take a hit without being staggered, so why am I using the heavy shit? The reason you use heavy shit is for poise, so if you can't use heavy shit, fuck knight armor plus two. Let's go to, to fucking... I'm at 82% right now. That is unacceptable. Oh, and there's somebody with a Smelter Demon armor. Oh, and that's somebody that I may actually uh, copy. You know what? Fuck it. Brigand armor is fine. It looks a little weird because of the kilt. That's fine. I don't need Dranglaic leggings. I need... Um, 68.8 versus 68.3... Uh, let's let's see knight versus uh, royal swordsman uh, royal swordsman has just a little bit more uh, I guess that is that slash defense let's see let's do a little bit of research here no just base physical defense uh, less against strike equal against slash but more base physical defense period that doesn't make sense oh I see it's the thrust well, still doesn't make much sense. Whatever. I'm under 70, so I can run. Let's just do this again. Let's do this again with a good weapon. A good weapon that is fully upgraded as far as I can take it for right now. Oh, oh, so much better. I know so many people who use this goddamn thing, but I don't care. I don't care if I'm fitting into the mold because I need a big fucking weapon right now. I have a lot of strength. I need a big fucking weapon, and I need it now, so FUCK YOU! DIE! Oh. <laughs> I can't win. Fuck big weapons, you know. I, fuck big weapons. I, I, I'm, I'm very serious when I say that I may just switch to my Jetstream Sam character, because, you know, he's, he's something. He is something. He is a magnificent character build. Oh, and, and and in one combo I can take these assholes out. That's nice. That's really nice. Oh, and I forgot to. Oh, I didn't reinforce my Estus flask at the bonfire with my. Uh, I should also upgrade my uh, pyromancy flame, but I'm not gonna do that until I kill. Until I kill this goddamn chariot. You know what? Fuck. Can you stagger, please? C can I win, please? Or, or am I just destined to... to... J just shut up. Don't say another goddamn word until all of these assholes are down. I swear. 
This this is stupid. This is ridiculous. And I know, I know, this is fucking just the MO of this game. It's what the game is designed to do. It's designed... I, I can't roll past that entire combo. That seems kind of odd. Oh! 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 Doesn't that just suck? You know, I, I have no problems being the villain. I have no problems taking away the fun from the people who've seen my misery and want to see more of it. Because you've seen enough of it! So I'll... I'll be the Detroit Pistons bad boy. I'll backstab this fucker and one-shot him. Because I don't have any choice. It's all I can do at this point. Oh, so, so sad when that happens, isn't it? So, again, 20 grand in souls or whatever the hell I had. It was probably more like 30 by the end of it. Uh, it's a lot for my level right now, but it really doesn't matter. It's inconsequential. It's more about the fact that I have wasted my time. That's the biggest travesty to me. Round two, motherfucker. And I swear it's so going to be different this time. The steed of hell cometh. And it takes you down with great vengeance. And oh god, you really are chasing me. Alright. Do not backstab me. Oh! I wish the chariot did as much damage to them as... Oh! Fuck! Welcome to Dark Souls, where I need a shit ton more endurance. Hope you guys have enjoyed, because this is the last time you're going to see it. Third time will be the motherfucking charm, you prick. On that, I swear. Come on, come on. Try it, you fucking skeleton assholes. Oh, oh, yeah, that's nice. All right. Oh, my God. Let's do it the right way. I, r I really am sick of these assholes. Like, die. Seriously. And I know how stupid it is to tell the undead to die. But I don't care. Hey, mail breaker. Do I care? No. I'm not going to be satisfied until I take both of this horse's heads as my trophy on a wall. And you can take that to the animal of animal rights people as if I gave two shits. Fictional horsey. You can die. You're more hell than Cerberus. Who's a fucking hellhound. Oh, look at you. Look at you with your big freaking infantry helmets. Yeah, they look nice and badass, don't you? Look at you. Look at you running after me. You want my head? Well, I want your freaking bones. And I'm dead. Aren't I? I, 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 <laughs> I don't care. I'm not, I don't care. I'm not stopping this video until I kill you. I'm not. No. No, I'm not. It's like I've hit a fucking brick wall. I swear to God, the more time that goes on, I'm feeling more and more hollowed. So I had to give Ragnaros an effigy, but it, it there, there is no replacement for the hollowing that has happened to my soul as a result of this. So, Executioner's Chariot, 
Piss easy boss! Let's just have fun ripping you a new asshole. I'm sick of your fucking minions. They're the only reason this fight is giving me any trouble. Well now, fucking necromancer douchebag. Look at you. Look at you. How's that feel? How's that feel? How's that one feel? Oh, you're still up? Not anymore. All right, I got an idea. Let's do this the way my sorcerer does it. Let's get a fucking alluring skull out just to absolutely piss on this last stretch. Ooh! They're gonna enjoy that, aren't they? I love ninja distractions. Alright, you guys can go there. Let's use a life gem while I'm at it. Yes, definitely helps to be more methodical on this particular fight. Oh, look at you. Look at you go after. Let me kill your fucking master. Get my souls back. And do it right this time. Oh, you're still up, huh? I don't need a skull to take you out now. You just die. Like you always should have done. Alright, I have one chance to do this right. Because I have no skulls left, and I don't know if I can buy them or not, so it's irrelevant. Let's do it right! Eat a dick horse, and by fire be purged! Look at you. Too stupid to know where I am, huh? Trying to buck when I'm too far away? Ugh. I swear it's not gonna happen again. You can sit there and do your stupid dark mist all you want. Ugh! Fucking Drangleic Shield is awesome. That's not! You know, fuck targeting. It doesn't help on awkward ass shaped bosses like this. I'm still too slow for my own fucking good. Oh, that's timings off, awkward. Ugh. Can I speak? Can I speak? It's awkward. Just like this fucking double-headed horse. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, go for your spit. How in the hell am I having difficulty with this shit? Damn it! Die! Take that, you fuck! Oh, I swear this game will sometimes kill me. Executioner's Chariot Soul. That's nice. Soul of a brave warrior. That's nice. Let's go up and say fuck this. What point or purpose did that serve? Besides wasting about 30 grand in souls, I could have 60 right now. Maybe more, I don't know. Hey, you! What is it? Oh, you trot long home. This place won't be any fun. Not for you. Would it be fun if I chopped your fucking head off with this goddamn greatsword? Because I think it would be fun. That sounds like fun to me. I don't give a shit if you're a Covenant Master. That is... Gren, I think his name is. He is the leader of the Brotherhood of Blood, which is basically the PvP Covenant of this game. And... Yeah. That's the only purpose this area serves. It, it's, it gives you access to the Covenant where you can duel anytime you want. And don't tell me that the Blue Phantoms can duel anytime they want, because they have to offer up a token of fidelity. Mind you, they don't lose rank if they lose their duels, but still. 
Ah, uh, I guess it's a horse piece. Anyway, uh, that sucked royally. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I I certainly fucking didn't. It took far too many tries, wasted far too many souls. Uh, I'll see you guys at the uh, Majula Far Fire, and uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Thanks a lot for watching, folks. Let me know what you thought with your comments and feedback. And if you really enjoyed the video, I've got a slew of other projects going on that I update regularly. So if you're interested, please consider subscribing to stay up to date. Have a good day, everyone.